close till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't wanna waste what's left And Welcome back to the channel. Currently, I am in Kauai, Hawaii. And before I get into the actual vlog, I just want to talk about the initial purchases that I made for the trip. Um, that includes car rental, flights, and accommodation. For flights, I flew into Lahue Airport from SFO and I'm flying out of Maui. And for the total round trip ticket in and out of Hawaii for my flight was $396.99. My friend flew from Seattle and she had to pay a total of six hundred dollars and ten you know six hundred and ten dollars and sixty cents and we also are doing um we're also changing islands so we're taking a flight from Kauai to maui and it was a direct flight from southwest and we had to pay about 45 dollars which is not bad and then for car rentals we rented off of turo and we just got a regular economical car it was a hyundai elantra and the total for that car, we're renting it for three days and it was $414.41. And then for accommodations, we're not staying in anything fancy. We just found the cheapest like hotel that we could find. And it's a place called Tip Top Motel and it was about like $150 per night. So we're staying there for three nights. So it's only about $440, $450. So that's basically all the initial purchases for that trip. Kauai is really expensive, but I'm so excited to be here. Currently, I'm in Tunnels Beach, which is this really nice, beautiful beach on the north shore of the island. We're currently doing a hike and it's called the Kalepa hike or Kalepa hike. Um, it's kind of near this lookout. It's not technically legal to do this hike, but the views are so so good. You have the this like view of the M Nepali coast and it's so like breathtaking. I'm gonna show you guys. So right here is like the Nepali coast and you can definitely see the ridges. And not gonna lie, this hike is kind of scary. If you're afraid of heights, I definitely do not recommend doing this and it's kind of strenuous. It's all downhill getting to a viewpoint. However, it's gonna be very like hard getting back up because it's all uphill, but the views are definitely worth it, especially if you want a challenge. I'm gonna leave like an all his trails link in the description box if you want, you just wanna check it out, but it's so, so pretty, I highly recommend it. So I got about 90% of the way, but the last 10% looks a little bit too steep steep and slippery for me that I decided not to go down and finish it which I'm totally fine because um, at other viewpoints like in the halfway mark you can still see a really good view of the Nepali coast so I don't think it's like necessary for me to go all the way down but I my friends down there she feels confident in doing it and there's other people down there to help her so yeah and the reason why I can't do it because I'm wearing flat shoes I'm wearing AF1 again I highly don't recommend wearing these. Good morning! So today is the second day of Kauai and yesterday was so tiring. We woke up at like 4 and left at 5 to head to a beach for sunrise. And when I talked to you guys, it was at Tunnels Beach. That beach was really pretty, but the sand was like not soft. And so it was a little bit uncomfortable to walk in. And then we went for a hike, which was like so tiring. I just did not want to do anything else for the rest of the day but right now we are at another beach for sunrise and it's so pretty here it's called Alio Manu Beach there's like no one here it's very secluded because there's like a tiny hike that you have to do in order to get here but it's like the we're the only ones here and sunrise is amazing and today we have another hike and then we have a boat tour today and then afterwards, we're leaving Kauai tomorrow and then heading to Maui. I'm not sure if this vlog is going to be great, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I'm just going to enjoy the rest of my time here and also take you, along, take you guys along with me for anything. And also just like post pictures. So 
we just finished taking pictures and now we're out hiking to this waterfall. Um, it says it's really challenging on all trails, but I think it's because it's like a little bit muddy, especially after a rainfall. But it should take us about like three miles round trip, which isn't too bad. But so far, everything looks like looks really pretty. There's like very rainforesty, and I could definitely hear the waterfall or just like the stream of water. And here I am hiking in my AF ones. This is not smart, but this is the only shoes I have. Following the linings on your cheeks, cause baby, in your absence, life is boring. So I'll never leave Last time I talked to you guys, we were hiking. I fell <laughs> once during the hike and it was really hard. I don't recommend it if you're not adventurous and not willing to like go through rivers, climb through rocks, climb through trees. We went through like 75%, however, we were like a little bit crunched on time and I was just like way too tired so I went back and then afterwards we went to a boat tour to see the Nepali coast. It was so much fun and it was so like pretty. I think everything about Kauai is like really pretty but I highly recommend um, doing a tour whether it's like a helicopter tour or a boat tour to, to check out the Nepali coast. But right now we're just chilling on the beach. I think this is our final night here. And then tomorrow we're just going to hit up a few more places before we head to Maui. Say hi! Hi! That's my friend Victoria. She's from Germany. She actually invited me to go on this trip because she's moving back to Germany. There's nothing like the way that you adore me I can feel love from miles away in your eyes tells me stories of life in a more perfect place where I wanna stay So I just got some malasadas. We're eating in the car because there's a lot of people at the bakery. Plus I forgot my vlog camera so I'm vlogging on my phone. I got ube, lily koi, mango, and pog which is passion fruit, orange, and guava. They look so good. They're from this bakery called Passion Bakery and it's in the Wailua area of Kauai. The wait was not too bad. It was like 30 minutes in line and then like five minutes for them to make it. I'm gonna try the pog one first. Mm. The malasada or the Portuguese donut is very soft and like airy. And it's like still hot too. The dough is like a little bit buttery as well. It's really good. I highly recommend it. I like the cream because it has like a tart flavor to it. Plus it's not too sweet. I think I like Lilikoi the best because I like tart flavors and this one's like pretty tart. Well, right now we're just going to head back to the hotel and get ready and then um, return the car. And I don't know when the next time I'm going to see you. But if this is the last time, thank you guys so much for watching and hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions about this trip, you can also just leave a comment. I'll try to answer and also leave me a DM on Instagram. I mainly answer on there. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye! It's